heard cows like mooing behind me. This is wonderful. I have never stayed on a farm like this before. While you guys have a conversation about it, I'm going to be working. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> stay, stay, stay. So cute. So cute. Ah, ah, no, 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 as part of our farm stay, we're doing little farming activities, which is, I guess, totally feeling absorbed in this rural experience. <laughs> 이게 1kg에 저희가 한 24,000원에 나가요. 어? 24,000원? 응? 가격이 셉니다. 여행사도 지금 So Doraji grows in a very stony <웃음> soil. So I can see why it's quite expensive uh, to purchase. It takes a while to uproot them. That's a very large root actually. My Doraji roots guys. My harvest. <laughs> so there were totally some moments there where I just totally couldn't couldn't just keep up with the beat. Oh. Because of the temperature of the oven, right. the kiln. 1,300 to 1,600 uh, centigrade degrees. We're now at a Celadon Museum. Korean Minhua Museum. But I'm really excited for the pottery experience. All of the different stages. This is from surface trimming, first baking, glazing, second baking. Our guide Marco told me an interesting story. He revealed that Goryeo Saladon was highly sought after both in the past and today. Goryeo master craftsmen were abducted by Japanese whose potters used Goryeo artisans to refine methods to later create luxury Japanese porcelain. About 10 to 20 years ago, Antique Goryeo Celadon sold at Sotheby's and Christie's auctioneers at the highest prices ever for ceramic wares. Today, Goryeo Celadon is recognized as the highest quality ceramics available on the international market. Yes, it is actually a little more challenging than you would think. It's, um, okay. it's almost like you have to really be in the moment and feel what you're doing. This apparatus reminds me a lot of a mill that used to be used to crush wheat like a hundred years ago. This is actually so interesting. Add the little beans slowly, slowly, almost like a drip feed. Then they find their way into this paste that you're creating that then just gets crushed and crushed between the two stones. Focusing on stirring the tofu in the center of the pan. I'm going to be adding some water that has been distilled.
Lookout view is stunning, isn't it? Sihua is not developed in the same way that other parts of Korea has been. It looks like Korea 20 years in the past, and as a result, Siwa Village was the chosen location to record scenes for a famous Korean movie. I can see mountains, I can see grey flats, which aren't particularly pretty, and then you see like these steps going down into these like little tiny homes that are absolutely gorgeous. There's a guest house right here. The reason why there's so many people gathered over here is because right behind me there is a store that was featured in a movie 1987 which was basically a pivotal movie that featured a student that got shot from a particular demonstration that thereafter went on to change the government voting system in terms of voting in the president so that citizens could actually vote for the president and not just an elite uh, group of people. So this was a particularly influential film in the Korean movie industry. <laughs> at some of the clothing of geiseng or entertainers similar to the Japanese geisha Korean version Thank you. 